Hey everyone, uh, welcome to this video. Today I'm going to show you how to use the newly updated RSS feed reader and how you can use it to easily and quickly pinpoint the most popular content across any niche using the power of RSS. And then I'm also going to show you where you can find the most popular RSS feeds across the most popular blogs across the web so that you've always got the latest content to share. All right, so if you've got any questions after the video, just comment below. Let's jump straight into it. So let's go to the RSS module. And this um, one here is content marketing. Each one of these is a separate um, RSS feed or bunch of RSS feeds. So as you can see, um, this one is one particular RSS feed. It's a Google alert. Haven't refreshed that. That's just there. Um, we can refresh that. Um, it could be that it needs to be updated. Then uh, this one here is content marketing feed. And this particular feed has got about 20, 20 feeds. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. There's about 30 feeds in there. It's about 600 articles. We've got right here all content marketing articles, the most popular and these are RSS feeds, so they're current, they're up to date, they were published sometime over the last month or so. Um, I imagine most of these blogs are updated fairly regularly. Um, so if you, you know, if you, if if you're, you know, deep diving into a niche, maybe you have time to to really read and find some of the most popular content. Um, however, if you're, you know, just looking for content to share for a client to add to a queue, and you want to make sure you're sharing relevant popular content, um, you don't have time to, to scan everything yourself. So what you want to do is you want to just make sure that everyone else finds its, finds its popular. So you right click and you order it by however and whatever you want to order it by. So let's order it by Facebook shares. Okay, so this happens to be smartblogger.com, 1300 shares. Look at all these buffers, pin 622 pins, right? You could also share it, see which one of the most popular pins. That happens to be the most popular one as well. But this one is the second most popular one here, so that changed. But Smart Blogger, they're definitely doing something right on Pinterest and across Facebook because they're, they're up there, right? Now we've got Reddit, so we want to see what's going on with Reddit. If you want to find, um, you know, popular Reddits related to your niche that are current and up to date that you can go in there and, and engage with, this is exactly what you want to be doing. So you've got the most popular content right there. No thinking about it. You can go ahead and right click that, open it up in the browser. You know, take another, um, you know, you, you can curate it. You want to curate it from the browser or from the RSS feed. You want to send it straight to um, your Publish Hub. You right click it and just click Curate. And that'll bring it over to Publish Hub here. And that Publish Hub will then go ahead and send it out to any of your WordPress.com or WordPress sites that you've got set up in the system already um, automatically. And that can go ahead and trigger via the RSS uh, any sequence using if this, then that, or, or what have you. So back to the RSS feed. Um, not only can you send and curate directly from RSS into Publish Hub, but you can also curate directly to your Facebook account. You know, this is, so this will be connected to um, the account that you're logged into for this persona, which is Ali. We're not going to post that right now. You can do the same thing for any of these um, social sites. I think Google Plus is probably going to be leaving soon, sometime soon. If you want to buffer it, you can use buffer. Send that to the queue. I think I may have already... Have I sent that one? No, nope, I don't think I've done that. So let's Firefox buffer because we're already signed in. And what this means over here, just by the way, so while we're here, is that if you click yes, it'll then open up a window that will give you access to all of the other personas here so that you can share this out to multiple places from here to wherever you want to go. So the windows will open up multiple, however many you click, and you just share directly from there. If you would just want to use buffer, and share just directly to this one buffer account at a time. Then you do that, add to queue, and it's done. Add to queue, great. All right, so there you have it. Um, let's talk about populating these right now. So you've got all of these, all of the, you have the ability now to add unlimited RSS feeds um, to each persona, all right? So now you wanna find these RSS feeds. Let's go back to Firefox and go to this site called Deliver It, which you probably are familiar with. But I don't know if you know that they are great for finding RSS feeds. So just click on this icon here. If you're somewhere else within the site, it'll bring you back to the home. And then you can do a search here for Internet 
let's say inter oops internet marketing see what comes up and now we've got all these internet marketing blogs some of the most popular blogs across the internet right there okay and if you want to add them to your RSS so you just come in here click that do internet marketing internet marketing and then click OK that'll open up another tab I've got a lot of tabs over here which is why I don't have them all refreshed so this will open up a, a pop-up window just pop that over there and then just just go ahead and make some space in there because you're going to be adding all these feeds so you just be dragging them in and you click you hyphen you just hover over preview and you just no, there you go. Oops. and you drag that in okay and you just keep doing that and you just drag them in and that's how you can v just easily find the most popular feeds across the internet add them to the RSS reader and then go ahead and find now we're gonna you can load them grouped or separately so if you if you load them separately it'll open them up like this so that you're not going to be looking at all of the blogs at the same time see this hasn't been uh, refreshed if you refresh that that'll start going through this particular feed and then instead of um, putting them all in one go I mean you can take this feed and you can also open them up separately or load them grouped so that you've got complete control of whatever it is that you want to do and if you've got um, YouTube videos in here it's also going to find them from the most popular YouTube videos so we've we got YouTube videos here somewhere here, here we go YouTube videos and then we can now have all these other options that are now appearing because it's recognized there are YouTube videos in there and you can order it by the views ratings and 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 the average rating so the most popular YouTube video across all of these feeds that you've added you go ahead and find as many feeds as you want for YouTube channels and then it'll go ahead and bring in the most popular stuff that's on their on their feed and there you have it okay so there you go if you've got any questions comment below thank you for watching